Hey, our friends, we're so glad you're with us today. We're going to make something super cool, right? Yes. What are we going to make? A pinch pot octopus. Yeah, good job. Are you excited? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, for this art activity, you're going to need a lot of art supplies, right? Yes. Should we show them what they need? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, for this project, you're going to want some kind of clay. We're going to use uh, this Crayola Mag Model Magic clay. We really like it. It's nice and soft. It's kind of squishy. That's what it says. Mm -hmm. But we really like using it. Um, it's white so that we can paint it. So we have a bunch of colors. And these are just acrylic paints that we have. We also have some paint brushes, a tray to put the paint in. We have some water to rinse our brushes out. Mm -hmm. And we also have a paper towel to clean up our mess when we make it. Yes. <laughs> we also have this paper that we're going to put down on, on, the, on the table later when we're painting our octopuses so that we can just paint on the paper and not worry about getting it, getting it on the table. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's clear this off and we'll get the clay ready, okay? Okay, okay we really like this clay yeah. because of how soft it is. And we are using this brand, but you guys at home can use any brand you want. And you don't have to use air drying clay. You can do this with just regular Play-Doh yes. and then not paint it at the end if you want to use colored clay. Mm -hmm. So we'll put that off to the side and we're going to split this in half so that you can have just as much as me. Okay. Okay. Well, we're going to take this and we're also going to split it in half again. It's so light. It is light. It's kind of foamy. That's why I really like it. Ugh. Do you do you need help? No. Use your, oh, you almost smacked me in the face. <laughs> All right, so we're going to take our first ball, right? And we're going to, our first uh, clump of clay, and we're going to clump, and we're going to make it into a ball. Okay, so we got our ball made with our clay, mm -hmm. and we're going to do the pinch pot steps for this part. And this is going to be the body of our octopus. And so if our friends haven't seen the pinch pot, we'll show them again. But we get it into a ball first, and we take our thumb, and we push it right into the middle. <laughs> push it all the way down. you got to use your muscles. <laughs> <laughs> your thumb looks like it's going to break. <laughs> Did you get it? Oh, good. And we want to make sure that it doesn't go through and make a hole on the other side, which you didn't. It looks really good. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to go around and we're going to pinch the sides of our clay so that we can open up, open up the pot and make it look like a bowl, a bowl. or a pot. A bowl. That's why it's called pinch pot. We're pinching the sides and you want to work on this one and I'll work on yours. Okay. Good job. You're doing awesome though. Look at that. This is going to be a really big octopus body, which I like. Thank it's going to be like. awesome. <laughs> All right, good job. Okay, we want to make sure also that the bottom of our pot isn't flat. So we made sure that ours was rounded. But if you're doing it on the table, a lot of times it'll be flat in the top. And that's so our octopus doesn't have a flat head. Look at that. He's going to have a nice body, right? Yeah. That looks awesome. Okay, let's put that off to the side. And we're going to first make our octopus's eyes. So let's get two little shapes like this that we're going to turn into balls later. We're going to roll them up into, there we go. Make sure that they're the same size. There we go. All right, Hads, how many legs does an octopus have? Eight. Eight. So that's an even number, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's show our friends at home how we get eight equal shapes or uh, pieces of clay. So we're going to split it in half once, right? Yeah. <laughs> and fill them, make sure that they're the same. You want them to be equal. Yep, those are, this one's a little bit bigger, but that's okay. Yeah. Then we're going to divide this one again. We're going to divide each of them in half. Oh, Sorry, I smacked you. Oh, you got me. <laughs> <laughs> so there we go. We're going to do that to the other one. So now we have four, right? Mm -hmm. This is fun. I love doing this. It's kind of like math. Yeah. Except it's art. Yeah. Okay, this, this one's a little bit bigger, so let's get a little more. There we go. Good. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, now we're going to divide each of these in half one more time. Okay. Good, we did it. Now look at that. You should have eight equal pieces of clay. Mm -hmm. Let me see if they're equal. Yes. 
I like them, and I like how yours are gonna be. Your your pieces are a little smaller than mine, and that's okay. Mm -hmm. That's because your body's bigger. Okay, so now we're gonna turn these into legs, right? Mm -hmm. And with octopus's legs, they're really long and thin, so we can roll them on the table like we're making a snake. A snake or a worm. Yeah, or a worm, and you don't want them to be too thin. That's perfect. Okay, then let's put it up here by our body. And let's do that with each of the pieces. So we should have eight when we're done. Okay. Now we got our legs all made. Our friends can pause the video so that they can catch up mm -hmm. with us. Okay, now we're gonna attach the legs to the body of our octopus. Okay. So we're gonna take first leg and we're gonna take it and we're gonna pinch it into the body like this, and then we can bend it around. Okay. okay, so you kind of, you attach it on the inside of the pot. So go ahead and put it in there. Okay. Right there, and then push it down. Yes, <laughs> good job. And then we're gonna make it bend around so it comes out the other side like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, you hold that, and I'll hold the other one. Okay, now we're gonna do this one on the other side directly. Ah, my legs are sticking together. <laughs> Now we're going to pinch and put the other one on the other side directly across from it. Okay. Okay, now we're going to get each of them and we're going to put them in here. And I'm going to do them kind of equally like this. So this one's going to be on this side like that. Take the next one. Pinch it in there. Wrap it around. Uh, <laughs> and then these ones will go right in between. Yeah, that's good. And then you can put one on this side too. And we rotate it around, pinch them, put them all on there. <laughs> is this fun? Yeah. This is so awesome. I love doing clay stuff. And sculpting. Sculpting. Put that last one on there. Good. <laughs> it's like hair to me. Yeah, it is kind of like hair. And then I'm going to get these this piece of paper and we're going to put our octopuses up, so back right side up on top of our paper. We're going to go <laughs> It looks like an octopus, doesn't it? Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> that looks cool with all the legs kind of going that way, but you can spread them out if you want. And our paper isn't really big enough. Yeah. But you could twist these legs around and make them do crazy stuff. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Mm -hmm. You could even, if your clay will stay, you could even have some of them sticking up that it's kind of fun huh but you want to make him look like he's alive his legs are moving around <laughs> it's awesome okay now we got our eyes and we got to put these on so we're going to turn these into roll them up so they're nice and spherical there we go and then you know what? We didn't say that we needed this, but I'm going to use a pencil. So I'm going to poke a hole into my octopus like this. And then that's where I'm going to put his eye. Oh, I should have made that a little bit bigger. We can make it a little bigger. We can put, <laughs> yeah, you can use that pencil. So I'm just making a, a little bit of a hole right here. Yeah. And then I'm going to put his eye inside of that hole just so it'll stay like that. Those on. I like that. You you made eyelashes. Let me I'll move it so that <laughs> our art friends can see. So you did a little texture on there and then you can put the little eyes inside. And you could even do, you could put a mouth on here if you want. Even though their mouths are on the bottom side, <laughs> you could put a little cartoon mouth on there. And then I'm going to use this to uh, put a little pupil in his eye. Pupil. Pupil. So pupil. we're going to just put a little hole in each of his eyeballs. There eye we go. Let's poke his eye holes. And that'll also keep his eyes from not falling out. All right, we did it. That looks awesome, Hats. <laughs> did you have fun? Yes. Uh, we hope our art friends had a lot of fun too. But let's get our paints and we're going to finish this guy by making him look really cool. Okay. All right. We got our paints all ready and you mixed two colors. What did you mix? Pink. 
Pink? Well, no, what were the two colors you mixed? <laughs> Red and white. Red and white, and it made pink, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so we're going to fast forward this, but we're going to paint our octopuses and make them look really cool. I okay. think you're supposed to say octopi, maybe, for plural. <laughs> I don't know. I, I have no idea. Let's just fast forward. Okay. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Heads, you did awesome. I love how she turned out. Give me five. Did you have fun? Yes. You promise? Yes. What was your favorite part? Uh, the head. The painting? The head? Yeah. <laughs> I really like all the texture and the pattern that you put on there. You used pink and blue and even some black. Mm -hmm. And I did some stripes on my legs. But our, our friends at home, you guys can do anything you want. You don't have to do it the way we did it. You can use any colors. You can paint it any pattern that you want. That's what's so fun about this project. We hope you guys had a lot of fun making your octopus with us. And one, one last tip that you may want to do is you may want to wait until your clay dries before you paint it. Because if, if you do it the way we did it, when it dries, the paint is gonna actually crack. We don't wanna wait though. We just wanted to do it really quick. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye. He's gonna get you wet. He's gonna get your paint. He's gonna get paint on you. <laughs>